Oh, don't mind us. We're just uh, getting ready to open up a 25 book pre-screen. We set it at 9.0. We have a vendor space in Post Falls, Idaho at Premier Vendor Mall. A lot of people are like, 9.8 or nothing on modern books. Well, I'm going to tell you right now, there are a lot of new collectors that don't need the 9.8 premium. We want to get people excited about comics. Support your local comic shop. Comic Tom put this out, uh, the shirt. We supported him. He supported us. Now we support new collectors. Let's see what books we can get in the hands of some new collectors. <laughs> So, those are my rejects right there. Uh, that means we got 23 graded books back. I'm excited to get into them. First up, and I don't know the grades on these. They will be 9.0 or better. First up is my absolute favorite favorite comic on the market right now. In a 9.6, we have Department of Truth number one. That is awesome. I actually read that exact book before getting it graded. So let me tell you right now, you read a book nicely, politely, without creasing it, it'll still come back solid. Next up, Ooh, we got some fire. Department of Truth number two in a 9.8. Yes, that is awesome. Also, a book that I read that exact copy of. Loving it. I don't know if you guys have read it. I had some crazy nightmares after I read the first three issues. It was fun. Next up. Oh, I'm stoked. Another book, speaking of three issues, Department of Truth, number three, in a 9.8. Yes! That makes me very happy. Oh, that makes me happy. All right, this is a cool book. Uh, it is a 9.2. It is a DC Universe logo variant, and that is a nice flash book right there. I'll read the uh, note that it says on it in the upper corner, flip it around. It is the first appearance of Impulse. That's a big deal. As we move towards uh, a bigger DC Cinematic Universe, Impulse is a big character that will be involved. <laughs> Gorgeous book right here. Not a, a major uh, key or anything. 9.8 Venomverse number one. New York Comic Con exclusive. That is awesome. Very, very cool. I'm like a little kid on Christmas. This is fun. Oh boy! Comic Tom! Support your local comic shop! This is a nice book. Straight out of the mystery mail call. 9.8. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Virgin Variant. Dude. Thank you for your support to the comic community, I'm shouting you out as loud as I can. Oh, darn, 9.4 in a very, very cool book that has major legs. We got the Spider-Man Miles Morales and Spider-Gwen Kiss. That is a cool cover. And I'm only jokingly sad about it not being 9.8. These were not pressed. 
these were not cleaned. These were books that I went over and I said, yeah, I think they got a shot. 9.4 is a pretty good grade. <laughs> Gambit, one of the hot characters in the world right now. 9.6. That is a cool cover. Number one. Yeah, X-Men Origins. They did an awesome number of uh, like one-off stories for the characters. I've got a uh, X Men two sixty six. Get impressed by E Rod. It's got a shot. That'll look really good next to it. All right, lowest grade possible. One of the most fire books in the box. I didn't know if it would make the nine point oh cut. We have the sixth printing of Ms. Marvel number one. It had some major spine stress. Uh, a press won't help some of the things. And the things that were wrong with this book, I did not think could be helped by a press. So I decided to risk it in the pre-screen, and it made it. Uh, I don't think that spine is that bad, son. I know, it's right along the edge. Like, you can't see you it. Can't, I, yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm happy with that. Orange is one of my favorite colors. So I was glad to get it anyway. Raw, that book goes for about 100 bucks. 9.0, it'll probably be 125. I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, and she's got the new series coming out. So that'll be a good one. <laughs> Comic Tom Strikes Again. Man, he's putting out some fire. This book has the last Ronin preview in it. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Peach Momoko. Number 110, 9.8. Damn! That's a good book. Very happy. And check out the back of this one. There it is! Ah ha ha If you're not subscribed to the Mr. Mail Call, I'm not getting paid from this guy. I don't have to tell you this. I just like his product. We're doing good, you guys. We're doing really good. We got another 9.8, and we're starting into the King and Black variants. This one's the spoiler, so watch out. This is number one variant. Check it out. Noel is kicking Eddie Brock's ass. And we all know what happens now because the series is over. But uh, that fight definitely changed over the course of the series. All right, we got, I mean, Todd McFarlane's amazing. The situation with Chadwick Boseman, keeping his, his life private uh, and his health thing that ultimately killed him. Uh, and this variant, I had to get it graded. 9.6 spawn tribute to Chadwick Boseman. That is an important piece of comic history uh, and recognition in the world that that life is bigger than comic books. I got a black and white one in here too. <laughs> and here it is, uh, linear in the 9.6. So that's, that's kind of cool. Uh, Having them both grayed out the same way. Um, you know, darn, they're not 9.8, but yay, they are paired together and, uh, you know, rest in peace. And I'm grateful that we get to still have uh, those memories of Chadwick. So, careful. Pretty loose in there. Is it? All right. Hottest book on the planet right now. Uh, this is issue number two. If it was 9.8, it would be monster. It's 9.4. It's still pretty damn nice. Uh, I, I need to get the trade paperback so I can read these. I did not read that issue. Um, I... You know, House of Slaughter. 
this summer free comic book day coming up, I will be picking up a copy of that. That's a nice book. So we had number two, and now we have number three, and we're getting a little better. So that's good. 9.6. Really, really nice. Really, really, really nice. That's exciting. Speechless. Doesn't happen often. Not near often enough. <laughs> now, I think this is the last one. Uh, we had two, we had three, and now we have four. Nine point six. Some people are mad. I ain't mad at that. That's awesome, you guys. Uh, I'm really happy with this box. And to get happier, we'll get back on the nine point eight train. We'll give more props to Comic Tom and the Mystery Mail Call. We got Phantom Star Killer. Mystery Mail Call exclusive. Really, really cool independent book. Yeah, buddy. I'm telling you right now, the slabs, the way they're framed up, this just makes makes them into pieces of art. It really, really does. Nice. This was one of my personal favorites of the King and Black. I mean, they were common, right? But that tattoo variant, really, really cool. And it's in a 9.8, so, you know, it, it'll command its premium price that's not really out of reach for anybody. Uh, 60, 70 bucks, something like that. And a really cool piece of history. Um, for one of Marvel's best arcs, uh, not necessarily best miniseries, but one of their best arcs. Hey, and another 9.8. Look at that. Also, for the friggin' 14th time in this box, Mystery Mail Call exclusive. Look at that. Not pressed. That means it was delivered to my door and sent to CGC in 9.8 condition. That is a pretty good deal. I did not read that particular issue. No. Oh, hey, this is a nice book. A lot of people don't know about this one. Uh, if it had come back in 9.8, I'd have been thrilled. But a 9.6 is darn good. We got Michael Keaton ready to reprise his role. And many, many people believe it will be the Batman Beyond character. This issue, arguably the first appearance in continuity of Batman Beyond. That's a nice book. We got a couple left. We're getting close. Oh, to go along with the other one, linear set, number 23. That is cool. I had an annual four uh, graded at a 9.6 or a 9.8 that I sold. Too bad I don't have it now to go with these, but uh, I've got the entire set, Batman and Superman, all the annuals, all the straight run issues uh, raw right now. So I'm going to hold on to those probably until the movie's a little closer. Look at this. So to fill up this uh, 25 book free screen, um, I had to pick a couple out of my like back bin, right? And this is just one of those wild independent covers which is hysterical because it is Chastity number one, Virgin.
because what is more virginish than chastity? And it is a darn nice cover. In the 9.6, it's going to have some value, surprisingly. Dad's pointing out the movies. <laughs> I mean, they were pointing themselves out, so... Just shaking my head at you, son. <laughs> And the last book in the box. Thank you guys for hanging out. We have a 9.6 really, really nice book. Metal Gear Solid. Check that out. That, again, you talk about surprising value. Uh, that That's carrying some weight monetarily. If it had gotten a 9.8, you're talking probably several hundred dollars. 9.6 is going to make it affordable. Uh, and now, let me tell you what. I get a chance to sell some of these and pay for my next CGC bill. Because I got like 80 more books out. So, hooray for us. Thank you, guys. We'll uh, talk to you later. Follow me on Instagram. At Travis Lawrence Knott. Bye.